We have been covering it at nauseum. The interior pressure and really the defensive line for the Las Vegas Raiders is probably going to shock a lot of people. We have been, we, I've been trying. By the way, welcome to the new studio. We'll be explaining uh, what every what all of this means, what all of this means, uh, uh, very shortly. But we're very happy to have our new studio up and running, uh, and we're ready to go with it. Absolutely ready to go with it. But there's a lot of different things I want to go over in terms of the interior pressure for the Las Vegas Raiders. Now, first of all. And most importantly, by the way, they're going to have probably the best edge rushing duo in the entire NFL, and we have, um, you know, we've covered it at nauseum. But second of all, and equally most important, even though we just said the first thing was most important, the Las Vegas Las Vegas Raiders defensive line, interior defensive line, that is. I think is going to uh, shock a lot of people. When we talk about the fact that the Raiders doubled down in the draft on defensive tackle, they, they brought in Bilal Bi Nichols from the Chicago Bears. You know, they, uh, they brought back a guy like Jonathan Hankins and everything he's going to bring for this defense. I don't understand why so many people are are sleeping on this on this defensive line. I don't understand it. Like I get it. It's cool to hate on you know the the, the people that uh, or r rather the teams that will uh, you know that just don't quite get it done at the end of the day. It's cool to hate on the teams that just don't quite put it all together. But that is not this Las Vegas Raiders defensive line. And I'm actually going to show you guys. You know I know we've gotten some uh, a little bit of flack for uh, this latest uh, first team roster projection. Now this is with a uh, a fourth. So now obviously this will change with a 3-4, but right now we talk about Max Crosby and Chandler Jones on the outside there. Like you're going to love it. But on the inside, that's what I'm actually equally excited about because if you can get solid into your pressure, it just leads and it bleeds into not only the secondary, which, you know, I think is, you know, we've talked about a little bit. A young secondary needs a good defensive line, but I think it will free up Max Crosby and Chandler Jones. And I'm really excited for, for the future uh, of guys like Matthew Butler and Neil Farrell Jr. Um, but also on the same token of that, like you've got some guys that might go a little bit unnoticed here, but it's our job to shine some light on those guys and make sure that they get the love and respect that they're about to get now. So we talked about it. Cleveland Farrell's a guy that if we're being being honest not exactly worth a top five overall pick or doesn't seem like it. Uh, i don't want to say he's a bust because i don't think he's a bust i still i still think he can have a very serviceable role in the nfl but you know uh what was it uh what was it 2019 that he was drafted was it four or five can't remember but anyway uh and i don't know if he was actually five point is i think it was four but the, at the end of the day the point is the fact that you know i think he's going to go into a different situation he's going to have i honestly i think every chance to be able to uh you know go inside outside you know you're going to be he's going to be a swiss army knife you're going to be able to use cleveland Farrell in a lot of different ways so you know just in terms of what patrick graham and this defense are going to cook up in ter in terms of the interior pressure i'm so excited and you can't sleep on it because yes i get it it didn't get exactly get the job done last year there was still a left uh, a lot left to be be on like to be on the field and I, I i get it but at the end of the day this defensive line make no mistake if you take nothing from my rambling on throughout today take this away on paper this defensive line for the las vegas raiders is immensely better than it was last year in both interior and the edge rushers like we cannot even debate that like let's be real about this chandler jones is an immediate upgrade over a guy like unique and now don't get me wrong unique and was a bad man that man could good have to get after the passer but chandler jones who has been who's been there done that got in the t-shirt in terms of being um you know what was it leading the nfl in sacks a couple of years ago like this man you know he's he's been in that club he is that guy that can be that premier pass rusher you know, Unique Ngagwe was kind of scratching the surface of that, but he, he was kind of, you know, kind of a diet version of that, if we're being real. But Max Crosby, he's a superstar in the making, uh, and has really kind of already shown that he's a superstar. But at the end of the day, you cannot sleep on this interior pressure for the Las Vegas Raiders. I think it's going to be one of the biggest gems that this team has ever seen. Uh, and I, again, it's on the backs of guys like Matthew Butler and Neil Farrell Jr. You know, Andrew Billings might be able to do something as well. Like, there's just so much talent on this, uh, you know, this defensive line by Lon Nichols a guy that had what was a five sacks with the Chicago Bears last year nobody's talking about it I think it's a travesty and I think it will come to light and it will uh, I, I think that a, this will defensive line will you know shut up a lot of the haters because I do think there's a lot of talent to go around here but let us know what you guys think make sure you guys like and subscribe let us know what you guys think of the new studio uh, you know there's still a lot coming you know I, I will we'll explain more about the studio coming up but this is kind of what we're uh, kind of what we're starting out with there's still a lot more to come like we said so but let us know what you guys think uh, make, make
make sure you guys also give us a like and a follow uh, down below. We got all our social media platforms in the description. Give us a listen and sub on iTunes. And finally, if you have anything else you'd like to cover, send us an email at thesportsbp at yahoo.com or put in the comment section down below and we would love to cover it. But let us know what you guys think about don't, about not sleeping. No, no, no. How do you how do you say it? It doesn't matter. Just don't sleep on the Las Vegas Raiders interior pressure.